Hey, what's going on guys? This video, we're gonna be talking about method overriding. Now we did talk about overloading. That is a different thing. Overloading is when you have a method with different versions. Overriding is when you replace a method. Monday.com is your visual project management solution. This is the tool that allows you to see where every task or project stands with a single glance. With a fully customizable interface, you can create the exact workflow that you need for you and your team to get stuff done. Monday.com is available on mobile and integrates well with some of the most popular tools out there. So get your life in order by giving it a try for free. Link in the description. So for example, if we're working with a class, there is a method to string. And you can use any custom object and you can always call dot to string. This is going to return some string representation of this object. What is that representation going to look like? Well, it really depends on what kind of object and whether or not there's some kind of custom definition for to string. When you do console.writeLine and pass in an object, it's automatically going to call that to string method. So if we want to basically define how a method is going to work, right, such as one that already exists here, to string, we can override it and create our own custom version. That's because if we're working with users, u.toString is probably not going to give us anything useful unless we make our own version which can do whatever we want. So jumping a little bit into inheritance, that to string comes from a class we inherit from. So user is ultimately going to inherit from object, and one of the things inside of object is to string. Inside of user, we can create our own to string method. Then when we create a user, we'll just name him u and call to string. Well, it's going to call this one. So we overrid this one and now we're using this one. So that's the whole concept of overriding methods. In the upcoming videos, we're gonna be teaching you how to do this. We're gonna explain the keywords, we're gonna explain virtual and all that stuff. So check it out, it's gonna be fun and be sure to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.